300 years ago, we were called wreckers. And when you hear them church bells ringing, you know it was a shipwreck. First one got out there, got the booty, baby. I am a pirate. Salvaging is definitely a war. It's a dirty business. I have competitors that are very interested in hurting our business because we've been hurting theirs. As soon as that call comes out on the radio, we're all racing there, and I gotta get there first. First one there gets the job. Motherfucker, look at this guy. Back the fuck up, you're in my area. They call me a pirate, a thief, a crook. Hey, you cut in front of me again, we're gonna have words. Why don't you stay away from me? You're the one coming over here playing with me. Remember who you're following all day, buddy. You wanna come on down here to our side of the bay, we're gonna eat you up. By the end of the season, we'll see who comes out on top. We saved a vessel almost worth a million. I can't hold it. The potential payout on that could be as high as $150,000. There's a $6 million yacht behind me over here. Put a fire out in that. Don't get no close, it took us like 14 minutes to do the job, and we got 150,000. Cash money, baby. I jump in the water. First thing I see, bam, lionfish, moray eels, gator, stonefish, sharks. Don't do that! All it is with you is bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. You're a pain in the fucking ass. Sometimes it gets into fist fights. Bad fights out here. Come here, motherfucker. Go. If I go down, you going with me. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. These boats start to fill up and sink fast. They go down quick. If that boat goes down and I'm stuck, I'm sinking with it. This is a job that you can get killed. You screw up, you could die. Simple as that. You have to be a little crazy to do it. There's no, there's no way around that. I'm a wrecker, baby. Because we can wreck some shit. I'm Ricky Arnold. My family goes back six to seven generations here in Key West. I'm a piece of the dirt. I've been salvaging boats all my life. I like to get nasty and dirty. The dirtier I get, the more money that we make. This is a completely family-run operation. Me, Ricky Jr., we call him RJ, and Shane, and the big boss, Doris, my wife. You know, we raise hell and bitch at each other all the time, but we work together good. I think that's why we've lasted in the business for almost 40 years. Come to the left, Rick. It's gonna be straight in those trees right there. It's right there. There's the bow of it right there. Yep. Just something about this harbor. I might pull 20 boats a year out of here, and every one is a nightmare. Let's start throwing bags. First dive in for me sucks. You never know what's waiting for you. Could be a body, could be a uh, eel. We're just checking the bags to see how much pressure's in them. Once they're full, we'll have 8,000 pounds worth of lift on the boat. If the boat doesn't move, we're gonna have to put more bags in there. Got this fucking boat coming up, god damn it! It's coming up! Right now, I'm trying to watch to see if the boat's leveling up or if it's wanting to roll. Oh, oh, oh! You son of a bitch! All the structure of the boat's gone now. Everything that holds the boat solid to make you be able to work is all gone. One day just turned into three fucking days. Fuck. I'm Cal Burke Capella. I own Atlantis Marine Towing and Salvage with my father, and I do marine towing and salvage because it's my life. I've done it forever, and this is what we do. I traded my house in Fort Lauderdale 
for a 52 foot catch 40 years ago. I started the business and I think the future right now looks real good. I want to spend time with you. I miss you. I bet you did. I miss you too, buddy. This is a family business. Born and raised on a boat. I don't live a normal life. My name is Joe Woodward. I'm the first mate and crew for Atlantis Marine Towing and Salvage. I got into the salvage business when I was about eight years old. I grew up here in a boat and I knew Bert from around the marina and um, just wanted a job. So I uh, picked up a job as crew on one of his boats. I live on the water. I live the business. The business lives me. I can't name how many birthdays, holidays, ring, the phone rings and vibrates in the pocket. Yeah, Atlantis, Bert, there's a boat sinking out here. They need you right now. Hurry, hurry, hurry. You know, boom, drop, jump, go. all to stand down because it's burning so heavy and so bad that they're telling us now that we got to stand down from it. Police telling us to stand down. There's no reason. We can put that out right now and still have integrity of a hull to make the removal process safer and easier. Yeah. Right now you're just letting it burn down and making it all the more harder to bring this boat out of the bay. When the value of the boat's over, it's going to be a wreck removal. It's just going to burn down to nothing. Oh, we just went burn. to go to Monty's to have dinner with the girls. We just sat down, put our feet up there. Yes! Boom! Bert, there's a boat on fire. Go, go, go. You see all this smoke? You see all this flames coming over it? <laughs> oh my god. It's insane. That's why we do this. Fuck yeah. Woo! Yeah. <laughs>